All right, let's do a quick message. Let's see what's going on in love currently for the collective. What's currently going on in love? This is a general message, so this is not everyone's situation. There's a past person, okay, that you could be thinking about or is thinking about you, but then you're accepting everything for what it is, that it was strictly sexual here. All right. Damn. And you are being safe and divinely protected out of this here, okay? So you may be releasing a person that you may feel very close to this person in some way, but it looks like it's strictly sexual. You're accepting it. This is what it is. And if you want to get out of this, you're being protected on the way out the door. Yep, you may decide to just be friends with this person or it started out as friends, but now you're having to accept that, you know what? This isn't going anywhere. This is just, yeah, look, it's going too slow is what you're saying. You, it's going slow. It's not going anywhere. There could be children involved in this situation that play a factor. Like you could have children. This person could have children. And maybe you guys are just on different pages when it comes to, you know, to family or raising, raising kids or something like that. All right. This could have been a, a situation where it was strictly sexual. Someone got pregnant. And now it's like it's, you're accepting that maybe the only thing that's coming out of this is a child. And, you know, you may be like, I love my baby, but, you know, this relationship isn't working. There is also a destined partnership. It says this is a destined partnership. So I feel that something needed to happen the way it happened. Um, you may feel like it's a failed situation, but I feel like you've gotten what you needed to get out of this here. Okay, whether it's a child or there's a lesson that you had to learn in this, I feel like you've le you've learned it here and you're getting the support. Um, to help you to move on to accept things for what it is here okay one more decision yeah and you're making a decision about the relationship at this point you're making a final decision about it or you and someone else is making a final decision about it you both may feel as though you're supposed to meet each other maybe there is some support here um in the form of a friendship with this person or something like that but you in the middle is strictly sexual and it's kind of like it's not going past that it's it's not moving it's going slow maybe you guys needed to take the time to get to know each other more or maybe this is something that you may decide to do for some of you who are not letting it go like that you may need to slow this thing down and take time to get to know each other and then see you know what becomes of it from there but i do see you having to make a decision about a relationship like what is it what are we doing where is it going okay anything else what's going on here in this relationship this situation yes yeah, someone here may be an extrovert and may express themselves bold this person may like to go out and enjoy time in social environments. So someone may be more extroverted, like to go out. It may not be about the person going out. It may be about what they do when they go out, okay? It may be about someone's behavior that you two may be in disagreement about. Yeah, someone could be living a double life. They may be married or involved in another connection or someone's hiding their sexual fantasies or preferences. So this could be a connection that started out strictly sexual a lot of fantasy and someone is just a little bit on the wild side compared to another person someone may even already be married or involve themselves in with other people and this could be what's causing a disconnect because it's like one person wants to settle down could have children could be more grounded and another person is more out there you know and they got secret fantasies and things that they're trying to explore while the other person is like wanting to be stable in a commitment so yeah it's definitely time to decide about that all right because i feel like someone is not ready for a commitment they may not be over a past relationship or they need to heal and end some things that's going on in their life you know if it's not third party it's just a behavior that someone has that is causing issues in the relationship here or or, or no relationship because it may not even be a relationship this could just be sexual you wanted you wanted it to go further but it's not going okay so this is what i have guys if this resonates leave it in the comments and i'll see you guys soon